Okay, so my last video wasn't exactly the grand finale. I completely forgot that I had three more of the little shoppies left of the Royal Trends to purchase and add to my collection. So here is one of the three. This is Princess Beryl. I believe she's a brand new character to the shoppy world, or little shoppy world. I thought at first that she was um, made up of grapes, and it still looks like it to be. But Beryl would make me believe that it's some kind of berries. So maybe she's made up of some sort of purple berry. I don't know what berries would be purple. But uh, we're going to go ahead and get her out of her box. I don't think that there's anything on her specific to her. But it does show her um, from the daytime dress to the glitter princess on the back. And then you can read that if you'd like, if I can get that to focus for you. Pause that and read it if you'd like. Let's just go ahead and open her up here. So inside you're getting four things. You're getting the checklist, which we've already looked at before. You're getting your stand, which is amazing all the time. You're getting your easy on dress here, and then you're getting your princess. Now here is Princess Beryl. We'll take a look at her. She has a crown that's all around the, her, a top bun. Um, the bun is not... I guess it's more like a Mary Jane hairstyle, but done in a bun with a golden crown around it. Her hair is more like a light lavender. She has light lavender eyes, a darker purple lip, and her complexion is probably medium, medium dark. Her dress is removable, just like all dresses um, from these Happy Places series. And she has a light lavender bathing suit on under there. Her dress itself is really, really awesome. It's based on either the berry that she represents or a grape. You have the light lavender top with uh, the transparent purple in the center with uh, green leaves. And then you move down to the bottom half of her dress. She's got the green leaves and vines that go on around that. I think I really think she's grape. And then you have uh, the transparent dark purple, which has a little bit of glitter, actually, in embedded in it. She has a, a different type of purple legging. And then it moves down to her shoes, which are also made up of these berries or grapes. All around, you can see the texture of that. And then in the back, there are the leaves, which I think looks like grape leaves. For articulation, her head goes back and forth. Her arms go up and down, and you can make her sit or stand or do the splits this way. Um, so let's go ahead and look at her dress that goes on. Because, unfortunately, these shot little shoppies don't, for the first time, don't come with petkins. They have a another half of the dress to replace that in cost. So let's go ahead and put her dress on. Supposedly it's really easy to put on. Just like the rest here. And there's Blaze. Say hi to Blaze. Dress blazers. And here is Princess Beryl on her stand. We have our dress on. I think it looks seamless. It continues the transparent purple, dark purple berries with the embedded glitter. And then we have three little leaves popping up in the front here. And a leaf in the back. Uh, she's pretty awesome. I'm pretty excited about her. She's actually one of my favorite ones, I think, from this line. I think I've pretty much said that out about all of them. But <laughs> uh, it's between her and Arm Armanda. But we're going to go ahead and walk her over to our castle display over here. Take you guys with, it, with me. And I think we'll just have her hang out right here in the front. That's all we have for you guys today. If you like this video, go ahead, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And we will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.